Hello, so let's suppose that I put an image in my LaTeX document using the include graphics command, but now I want to either rotate this image or reflect it. So let's do the rotation first of all. So after I've included my graphics, but before I've defined the name of my image, you can see that I've put some square brackets. And in this case, I've defined an option of the width, so how big I want the image. But if I put a comma and I define an angle, in this case, 30 degrees, you can see that if I recompile, the image on the right gets rotated 30 degrees clockwise. Great, let's reset set that and let's talk about reflections now. So let's first of all go for a horizontal, in other words, a left to right reflection. And to do that, I just wrap this include graphics in a reflect box. And you can see here that if I recompile, it just gets reflected left to right. Now let's reset that and let's talk about a vertical reflection. So in order to do that, I'm going to wrap this image in a scale box. You notice scale box takes the first set of curly brackets as one. That just means that I don't want to make this image bigger or smaller. I want to leave it the same size. But the second set of square brackets is a negative one, which means that I'm going to be reflecting vertically. And obviously the last set of curly braces embraces this include graphics. And you can see that on the right, the image gets reflected vertically.